I know we've caused the problems, and I know we also hold the key to the solutions. And find out how they plan to survive it. Let's do it. Life at 50 Degrees. Watch on iPlayer. Hello, I'm Christian Fraser. You're watching Context on BBC News. With the United States still reporting almost a million COVID cases per day, I'll be speaking with Andy Slavitt, who has advised the White House on its approach to the pandemic. Here in the UK, with the cost of living soaring, we're going to ask if the government will fulfil its pledge to cut taxes on home energy bills. If it smells fresh and it looks fresh, then the milk is probably safe to drink. A major supermarket is replacing the use-by dates and asking us to apply the sniff test. Very much not past their sell-by date. Tonight's panellists are back with The Context. Sonia Khan, former Downing Street advisor to the UK Treasury, and Amanda Renteria, who was part of Hillary Clinton's presidential campaign team. The good news in London is that the worst of the Omicron outbreak appears to be behind us, although the case numbers are still high and the case numbers in the rest of the country are still rising. In the worst case scenario, 25% of the public sector workforce could soon be under lockdown. And so the price